This is just a quick video to explain how to calculate area weighted R value and I'm going to show an example of how to calculate that using this little calculator. So the uh, formula to calculate area weighted R value is you just need to know what your total area is and divide that by your total UA which is uh, your U value times area. So in order to get U value, you need to know what your R value is, and you can just take the inverse of that. So the calculator is going to take the R value and put 1 over the R value, and that will give us our U value. And then the calculator will take the U value and multiply it by the area to get UA. So we just take total area divided by total UA, and that will give us our area weighted R value. Now the most common scenario for area weighted R value for me is, is the scenario where you're trying to figure out uh, what your area weighted R value is for your attic. You have an attic that's really well insulated, but you found that the attic access is not insulated at all. It's just a sheet of drywall. So let's put that scenario into the calculator. We have our main attic as one assembly and we have the uh, attic access as the second assembly. The R value of our main attic, let's say it's an R42. And since our main or our attic access is only a piece of drywall, that would end up having an R value around half of an R, so 0 0.5. And you can see the calculator just automatically calculates the U value for you. And then we just need to know the area of each of these assemblies. So if our main attic was 900 square feet, and our attic access, let's say that it was two foot by three foot, so we'd have six total square feet. Uh, we put that in there, and the calculator just adds up our total area, so our total area is 906, and it's also taking that U value times the area and getting our UA, and then it's calculating what our total UA is. So you can see that total area divided by total UA gives us a weighted R value of 27.10. So that attic you thought you had an R42 in, by leaving that little bit of insulation off of the attic access, it actually drops the overall R value down to an R27. So hopefully this em emphasizes how important it is to insulate an attic access, but also know that you can use this calculator for other uh, building assemblies. Another example would be a foundation. Let's say you get down in a basement or a crawl space and the uh, half of the wall, half of that foundation wall is insulated and the other half is not. You can just put in the top half of the wall, its R value and its area, and the bottom half, its R value and its area, and it'll give you the area weighted or the combined R value of both of those. So hopefully this helps. Have fun and good luck.